What's up, everybody? It's Jay the Whiskey Pirate. I'm taking a look right now at the Glenalki eight-year-old release. That's right, I said eight years old. This is exactly the kind of whiskey that proves that age is definitely not everything. Bottled at 46% ABV, this whiskey is matured using a combination of Oloroso, Pedro Jimenez, Virgin Oak, and X-Red wine casks. It's as easy and delicious as it is dangerous. It's the kind of bottle that you can pour for your friends who maybe haven't had any single malt scotch whiskey before or have that assumption that just every scotch whiskey out there is gonna be smoky and peated. On the other side, if you're a seasoned single malt scotch drinker and you just appreciate a really solid drinker that's just very well balanced and again, very easy drinking, well, some would call this a breakfast whiskey. Like you could have this with your toast and your fruit cup on a Sunday morning. Yeah. Now, a different path from their 12 year old release that they're very well known for. I think of that whiskey as more of like a fruit and spice. This whiskey is just light and fruity. Some may find a little bit of a chocolate character too, but think like a honeyed fruit salad, a little bit of candy ginger. All in all, it's just really super tasty and ideal for that beginner's palate, but just a solid drinker for those that know how to appreciate a well-balanced whiskey and something that's very, very solid. It's no secret that Glenallachie is making some fantastic whiskey, and this just proves that age doesn't mean anything at all. About $70 for the bottle, which if, again, you're a fan of the 12 or you've already had that, is about in that same price point. but Please don't let the age and the idea of price cloud your judgment. I will admit that even though I already knew Glenallachie, again, they make really good whiskey, this genuinely surprised me, and it's really, really good. So check it out. Let me know what you think in the comments. I'll catch you again for more.